what if having the wrong political views could get you canceled? I mean, not just from social media, but from your bank. You may be surprised, but some conservatives say it's already happened to them. And that's why there is a need for alternative banking options. My next guest served two terms as governor of Oklahoma. Now she is a board member of a brand new bank that aims to help patriots stash their cash without fear of being canceled just because of their political views. Please welcome to the show, Governor Mary Fallon. Governor, great having you here. Thank Governor, you. Governor, good to see you, yeah. I am totally excited about this, and it's uh, involving you, Dr. Ben Carson, John Rich, who's been on our show several times, Larry Elder and others. What's the genesis of the idea of the Old Glory Bank? Well, you're exactly right. The council culture has affected the banking institutions, and there have been citizens that have had their accounts frozen or canceled because of their views. It could be a view on anything. And so Old Glory Bank, which I'm very proud, yeah. based in Oklahoma, yeah. I'm very proud of that. And Old Glory Bank, by the way, bought another bank in Oklahoma, changed the names. The bank's been there 120 years, but it's a digital first banking platform that is an FDIC insured chartered bank that's in Oklahoma, but it's, it's a digital platform to where you can carry your bank in your pocket Hmm. And you can bank, you can pay people, you can accept money, you can deposit your paychecks, and you can bank wherever you live, because that's really how people operate these days. The beauty of the Old Glory Bank concept and the banking platform is that it stands for values, and I think a lot of American people are concerned about values of respecting the flag, you know, saluting the flag, values of freedom, of liberty, of your privacy, of security, of wanting to know that you have someone that's taking care of your hard-earned money you know, hard-earned hard -earned money from regular people, middle-class America, that's put in a financial institution that someone has similar values yeah. to you and won't cancel you out just because you believe in something or maybe don't believe and, in something. And people don't realize, but for example, certain gun dealers have been told by their banks, we're not going to let you have a checking account. Exactly. We're not gonna have you access credit cards, which basically means you're out of business. So it's happening to firearms dealers, it's happening to pro-life groups right. who are basically being told, you are not going to be able to access the bank. I mean, this is, honestly, it it's sounds crazy. like the stuff, mark of the beast business, where you can't do business because the banks decide, we don't like your politics. That's just disturbing. Yeah, that's right. And, and that's why Ogori Bank, I think is gonna be a huge success in the nation. I mean, GoFundMe, not too long ago, decided that they were not going to allow people who gave through their platform to give to the truckers in Canada. PayPal announced recently. Now these are major, most all of us have done something on PayPal or GoFundMe, so we're not talking about some obscure situation. Well, you'll never get canceled with Old Glory Bank. Hmm. You can express your values, your beliefs, and you'll have people standing with you that believe the same values and beliefs that are traditional American values that are important and made our nation the greatest nation, I think, on the earth. I guess the one way they would get uh, canceled is if they took out a loan and didn't pay it back. <laughs> well, that yeah, might yeah, be a little sure, bit sure. problematic. But, but you know, I'll, I'll give you a quick example. My, my son, who's 31, hmm. married, expecting his first baby. Wonderful, congratulations. But he invested a small amount of money, you know, thousands of dollars in his late 20s. He got a call from his best man at his wedding and he said, hey, I'm sorry, but I've got a, I've got a, tell you, I gotta give you your money back because our financial institution doesn't want you to have your money with our account. And he said, well, it's not that much money. What did I do wrong? And he said, well, your mother was governor of Oklahoma. He said, well, that's the key to it. She was, yeah. but she's been out three years. So why would they cancel my account? I don't even live in the same state she lives in. He said, well, I don't know. I was just told I had to cancel your account and give you your money back. So it does happen. It's crazy. If Apple decides that Apple Pay will no longer serve people who have a strong conservative view, uh, you know, that, that takes out a whole bunch of other people. You bet, you bet. So, you know, it's pretty evident that this is a very serious issue. And it's amazing that you guys are putting it together. I wondered, when is somebody gonna come out with an alternative? Now they have, and well, you're involved. And it's real exciting. I know there's a lot of people that can't wait for it to come out and it will be available to everybody in America, no matter what, what your financial condition is, even your businesses. You know, the, as you mentioned, businesses yeah. get canceled. If you're in a certain energy sector, and maybe you're an insurance company that provides for the energy sector. A lot of times in, insurance companies say, don't, you can't, you can't write for the energy sector. 
or it, it could be anything, a banking institution say you can't give a loan to the energy sector, whatever it might be, they get canceled out. It's so, absolutely stunning it's that the commerce between Americans would be prohibited by some financial institution that decides that it is bigger than the Constitution and freedom. Governor Mary Fallon, thank you very much. And for our audience, I hope this will make you think about that uh, maybe the old glory bank model is exactly what you need to be looking at. So if you want to learn more about old glory bank, when you click over to Huckabee.tv, we have links that you can find out more about it and also follow Governor Mary Fallon on social media. Hey, Mike Huckabee here. Listen, if you love your mom, apple pie, and being conservative, you know you ought to subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell and click the like button and show all the leftists out there that conservatives are thriving and patriotism is far from dead. Am I pandering too much? No way. I'm just getting started.